Okay, this is Bepicha, and we are back in the infected. Ready to get some building going on here. Oh yeah, the uh, dev dropped another update on us. The guy's awesome. I don't know how he keeps doing it. It's a single guy, so he's a... Uh, He's doing everything he can for us. He's awesome. Although he did nerf the rock grinder, which isn't a problem because four times the sand and three times the iron is was a little extravagant for us. So he, uh, we're only getting double the sand and double the iron now, which is, you know, it's still good. But I did kind of go nuts on it before he changed it, so I got plenty of sand and a boatload of iron. But, you know, hey, I can deal with that now. So, uh, oh, he also gave us an oil pump, which I have set, but I have not built as yet. Um, then the oil pump will, within a certain radius, automatically give oil to any extractors we have built. So, any ore extractors that we have built within a certain radiance, it will automatically supply oil to, and we won't have to dump oil into them. So that means the clay extractor, the extractor I have for copper, and the two extractors I have for iron will auto be, auto be, will be auto supplied with oil. So that is awesome. Oh, he also added sun resistance so we can get sunburns now. Kind of an annoyance, but you know, that's all right. We can deal with that. This is a survival game. And now, uh, you know, we do need to survive. And now there's a Vambi walking around in my house. How dare that Vambi be walking in my house? I wonder if he's going to go all the way around. We'll find out. Um, uh, what else did he do for us? Um, oh, also, uh, for the sun resistance, you see I'm already down to 64%. What time is it? In the afternoon. So once it hits evening, that sun resistance will get better for me. Um, I can use potatoes to make a potato paste for, like, a sun, to ease the sun resistance. And also help sunburn. I don't know. If that, would you call it that? Bambi's going back down. Good boy. Um, there's some other stuff, but not really. Nothing I can think of at the moment. If it comes to mind, I will talk about it. But right now, we are just going nuts on these walls. And I think he fixed the cart getting caught on the stairs because we are up on the 17th floor. I do have the cart set so we can check that out again once uh, we get to that point. We'll see if we can go up to 18 and we'll see how far it works. Because once it starts getting caught on the stairs again, we're going to stop going up. Oh, and I've been going nuts on uh, uh, cement or concrete. So uh, sooner or later, we will start upgrading at least the floors. I haven't made any bricks yet, so uh, I'll have to make another brick dryer um, to really get going on that. So for the walls, but I think we'll stick with the floors at the moment and anything concrete because I am kind of low on clay so I may have to make another clay extractor but uh, with the uh, oil pump or oil well because it's actually like an oil well so you know after you drill a oil uh, a well it has that oil pump you know that you see in movies I guess um, and that's what it looks like it's a big old oil pump it uh, we won't need to feed. It will never run out of oil, so it'll they'll keep running until 
the storage box on them are is full. Man. I have enough room for it. Wait, now that I'm, is that the same van me coming back up? Jeez, dude. Make up your mind. Up or down. In or out. Uh-oh. I see my sun resistance is getting down there. Do I have shadow shade anywhere here? No, I don't. Let's get, go down and get into the shade. Sun resistance at 2. Get down into our into the shade here. Well, we can put this stuff away at least while our resistance goes back up. I haven't been out in the sun that much since he added it, so actually, it's the longest I've been in the sun going in and out. I haven't had it go down that far before. Hmm. Herbs, that's 35, that's 50. I kind of want to do the fruit salads because that gets my stamina up. As you see, I've got my thirst up to 200, then that's max. I've tried getting it up higher and it does not go any higher. Come on. Ah! Did he get me? If he did, it didn't really do a whole lot. Really, give me an aluminum oil. Here, let's stick that in here. Really? That's that's stone. Get this cooking. Sun resistance back up. Let's go back up there and keep placing logs. bit of shade here. Does that work? Nope, it's still going down. Okay. This should fill up. Yep. Yes, I can't stay out in the sun. What time is it here? Four in the afternoon, so the sun should start going down soon, which will help our sun resistance. start sleeping during the day and working at night. This is the issue. That sun is a pain in the butt. I mean, restocking stuff isn't a problem because I'm going in and out. I mean, even tree shade is supposed to work for it. So, I mean, I haven't had my sun resistance down to zero before. So, it hasn't been a major issue for me until doing this.
Really, I'm full. Really? Oh, one went over the edge. I lost the log. It's probably in the water. Can I see? No, I can't see him as yet. So far away, I can't see all my iron crates. Can't even see the sand crates I have over there. Because I loaded up a bunch of sand crates too and set them up. A level up from down there. The other one go off the edge again? Must have. Darn it. That's full. I'm full. So far away, I can't even see the iron crates that are in that corner, and there's a bunch of them. I, there's sand crates there, and I have them going all the way up to the corner. Let's use these. We're just up too high to see those iron crates.
grab all of these, or as many as I can carry. Stocked. Okay. Let's uh, check this out here. First of all, save. Just in case it gets stuck, I can reload. Up, oh, we got her up. Yep, that's it. We can keep going. Cool. Come on, there we go. Oh, hey, since I'm there, let's grab these two. Okay, let's get these floors set. Yeah, sorry I didn't get anything uploaded yesterday. I'm actually recording this last night. I'll have to edit it to in the morning. Um, I had uh, some stuff to do with friends, so... Yeah, I actually have some of those. Amazing, isn't it? Kind of looking for the cave. I think it's behind these trees right there. Hmm. Interesting. Nido. Okay. Ooh, are we over? We're, are we, we're almost over, totally over the lake. Uh, what am I looking for? That's what I'm looking for. Sometimes I'm a little slow. I know, sometimes. These floor sets. And then we will go down and probably assemble that oil pump. And see what that sucker looks like when it's all together. Right now it's just a ghost image. No! Two of them. What? Well, at least it landed on the inside. Okay. Can't quite see that far yet. A few more levels up and we may start seeing the river at least. But we can't see the cobalt area as yet. But damn, look at that view. That is spectacular. Love it.
Okay. Is this one? Sorting log shadow. Ooh. I know I'm weird. That is awesome. Oh wow, I just noticed our uh, sun resistance again. Let's get these things placed. What time is it here? 8.29, that should actually slow down pretty soon, I'm guessing. Especially if it starts getting dark. Awesome. Let's get down into at least into some shade here. Does that help? I mean, I'm in the shade, right? Sun resistance is going up. So let's go check out that oil pump. And I have everything in crates right next to it. I didn't mean I was actually looking for the sink, but okay. Let's uh, check out. Proteins aren't really needed yet. Let's eat this. Vitamins are 35. Let's get that up too right away. But this should get up my vitamins, right? Yes. But I'm actually more interested in my stamina at the moment because the stamina goes up to 300. Really? Really? You're gonna do that, huh? Just because I came down by ya. That's what I say to you. Stupid fox. They just repaired these two. I just, just repaired them. Now look at it. You took six damage on them. I hate you. See, there is the silhouette of the oil pump. And I have everything in these crates. And as you see, we need 20 mechanical, 20 electrical, 50 iron and 20 steel and I'm thinking I might build one of these at the aluminum and the cobalt areas so that when I go back there I will be full of stuff oh man let's get rid of that and that let's see if I can grab stuff then Take all. You know, while I'm thinking of it, why don't we check out... See, it's less than three quarters for... I wonder if that's going to fill up when I have the pump built or not I'm just kind of curious how that's gonna work so I got all of that stuff so I got all my iron in there all my me mechanical parts all my electrical parts now we just need the 20 steel oh and I need to I'll need to increase my electric too because this takes 100 power also to operate which means I won't be able to do it. Why did he run upstairs? He just ran right upstairs. What the hell, dude? Where did he go? Did he run outside? Because I've seen him do that before. Must have run upstairs.
There he is. Oh, I'm a bad shot, aren't I? Really, I don't see it. Either I'm blind or I don't know. Where the heck would it have went? Not a biggie, I can always make more of them. Well, we are going to, let's go check out our power at the moment. And I moved the switch box here because that's the only way to turn this on and off is this. So we're running a 100 power deficit right now. Oh no, the oil pump is 150. Holy crap, holy. Wow. And uh, let's get some rocks in the little grinder here. And until we get our, let's see how much oil we got coming here. I think I might turn these off because the only thing I really need these for now is the weapon grinder to sharpen our weapons. And uh, the saw bench because this, the saw bench uses oil. And I don't think it gets auto. It does not. Let's hang on. Let's remind you, we have that built. What do these look like now? See, there is actually no fuel requirement on this now. It will just keep extracting. Well, I'm assuming until this fills. Let's. I'm curious. Does it reach over to here? It does. Awesome. We will keep getting iron and stone out of that. That's cool. Sweet. So this is sand, right? And it's not even completely full. It's close, but not complete. Now let's go. I'm going to show you what I have collected. I have some. I think I have a partial sand somewhere. Crap. Mm -hmm. I guess I do not. What's over here? Here, I think this. Oops. Can that fill it up? Nope, I'm one short. And I and need energy. So let's pull one out of there to fill this up. Let's go take a nappy nap real quick. I think just enough to get us some energy. I'm going to show you what I've got stockpiled here. So the sand. been placing up here. Stick this right about there. And all of these that's all sand. And these they're all iron ingots. The grinder. Well, these are from the grinder. As well as all of that sand. So I've got plenty of sand. 
I won't need sand for a while. But I may build another clay extractor because that I will need more of. And I might build a bench right down here because I can't make this clay soil into clay without a bench and I'd have to carry that upstairs to do so. And it's no, that's not happening. Okay, where do we have a good vantage point? Oh, it's dark time. We won't get a good vantage point, will we? Well, sure we will. Because this thing is just a behemoth of a building. Look at that thing. It's flipping huge. Okay, well, this has been Vepidra. And, uh, you know... Do those three things that'll make us both happy. Click on that like, give me a subscribe, and ring that bell so you can see me next time. Later.